Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm back with the haul, and I'm back with the ColourPop haul, and it's been a long time since I did a ColourPop haul. So I'm excited. Let's get going, and we'll get started with the Supergoop Glow Oil SPF 50, and really important all year round, but summertime even more important. And then um, let's see, as far as what I did for my base today, I did go ahead and use the ColourPop uh, Pretty Fresh Foundation. I have mine in 30 Neutral. Added in a little bit of the Soul Body. This is an older bottle. It's their uh, bronzer for fair skin. And so I mixed a little bit of these two together to go ahead and get the color that I have on today. And then as far as what I did for the cheeks today, oh, and I have everything all over everywhere, uh, ColourPop, and I did Coconut Beach. This is actually the older packaging, and so that's what I have on for my bronzer today. And then I did go ahead and use Let's see, this is Sounds Grape. It's one of their Super Shock as, as far as their blushes. So I had that on. And I did go ahead and mix highlighters, and that was kind of an oops today. So I did go ahead and use the ColourPop uh, Seismic, and I went ahead and put that on. And then I realized the part of my ColourPop haul was, were the drops. And these are... Um, yeah, can't really read them. Liquid Light. Okay, so Liquid Light, it's their new highlighter. So I actually have a blend of these two on today. And again, that's my bad. And um, <clears throat> it just comes into habit. You know, you're so used to, if I reach for this blush, then I reach for this highlighter and this bronzer. That That's sort of what happened there. Oops. And um, let's see, what else did I do? Oh, this is the lightest color of the um, highlighter. And um, I did do a swatch here. And the swatch is just of the highlighter itself. And that's very, very glowy. It's uh, this is very definitely liquid highlighter. I didn't have any problem applying it. And yeah, it will definitely shine into the next star system for you. And then um, I did go ahead and pick up one of their So Juicy. This is Guava. And um, this is actually the Guava shade, and I had that on. I did put a little bit of the NYX Butter Gloss Bling over the top of it to go ahead and give it a little bit of glitter. And actually, mm, I just managed to get something in my eye, believe it or not, and I will be right back. Okay back again. Don't know what happened there. Usually, <clears throat> yeah, back again. Uh, so let's go over what's on the eyes and then actually let's finish with what's on the lips. So uh, this is the guava shade and with these um, they, uh, they're they just like the tart ones except for these are only like eight or nine dollars instead of 24. And uh, they are plumping. They have a little bit of a cooling effect, but not even a lot of that. Um, and they uh, they give you a lot of moisture, a little bit of color, a little bit of color. And then since I'm doing an all glitter look today, I went with the NYX Bling on top of it. So there's the lip look. And um, these actually feel really nice. They really do. As far as what I have on the chest today, I do have the She Glam, and so uh, this is their lotion. I have that on there. And then I have the ColourPop Twilight Palette, which is part of my haul today. And so, um, yeah, I wasn't one of the people that stayed up late to get it. I figured that I'd just wait till it was available. And it is available now on the ColourPop website if you want to go ahead and order it. So I went ahead and um, got it. And so this is my look today. I started off with this in the corner. Then I went ahead and layered this. Uh, it's actually a glitter formula and they've really worked on their glitter formula to the point where it's really nice at this point. And so I have this on top of this one. 
and then at that point I went ahead and did this on the inner lid and then this shade which I'm pretty sure is a duochrome like I said it's a first impression so I haven't really played with these but I went ahead and put that right up in here and it does have glitter in it as well so I know there are at least two glitter shades here yeah I think there are only two um, but anyway and then I went ahead and used this as my eyeliner on the bottom here and so this is how first impression with this came out and I think that I'm really going to enjoy this palette it's definitely my color story and I'm just really excited to have gotten it and to be able to play with it and so and I'm very thankful to have gotten it too okay and I did do some swatches here at the palette so yeah um, these are the swatches again Colourpop quality is just amazing and beautiful and the particular look I got just has so much um, glitter and shine and just pops so much it's so much fun so anyway um, yeah the glitter shades are a lot of fun um, I like them a lot better now uh, when they first came out with the glitter I would only put it like up on the very top of my brow because I didn't want it getting anywhere near my eyes um, but the formula has gotten better to the point that I feel that um, I can go ahead and you know it, it, they've refined the glitter and it's smaller and they have a really good formula that sticks so now I go ahead and do glitter more glitter in other places so and so um, let's see what else did I have in my haul I had some really good stuff I had the glisten up um, this is an illuminating mist. It has mica in it. I don't know if you can see the mica from here. It smells like oranges. Uh, I think it's one of the best products that ColourPop has ever really done. Um, I've repurchased it. I've lost track of how many times I've repurchased it. So if you're looking for a setting spray that's going to be illuminating, this is definitely one. Um, the other one that I really using and really liking is the Power Grip, the Dewy Setting Spray by e.l.f. and these two they give you a lot of the, they definitely aren't dupes for each other, this doesn't have any mica in it so it's not going to give you any glow um, and this one definitely has oil in it, I think this one has a little bit of oil but definitely not as much as this one so um, yeah, repurchase this one and um, got a couple of palettes as well so I went ahead and picked up the Lost in Love palette which was their Valentine's palette and so I really am enjoying the thought of going ahead and putting orange red and pink together this particular summertime they did a lot of that last uh, summer as far as clothes and different skirts and different tops and mixing the red orange and pink together and so yeah I thought that I'd go ahead and do that on the eyes during the summertime and so I'll definitely be doing some looks with this and I know it's been out for a while and the packaging is just it has plastic on it, like raised plastic. It's it's very psychedelic. It's kind of 60s feeling going on there. But anyway, um, I did get one other eyeshadow palette. And I picked up the So Elemental. Um, yeah, I actually kept on seeing this available over at Ulta. And at one point they were saying that it was actually available in store and I went in store and it wasn't there at all and I went to two and I don't live in an area where there are a lot of Altas so finding two for me is a really big deal so <laughs> the fact that it wasn't there kind of put me off but um, yeah yeah I couldn't stay mad at it. No, I couldn't stay mad. So, uh, yeah, I'll be doing some uh, looks with that as well. And so uh, that's my haul. I haven't ordered from ColourPop in a while, but I was not disappointed with quality or anything in what I got. And in fact, they have a couple of products that may actually be really good for summertime, especially if you're fair. This uh, Soul Body 
face and body, it's a bronzer. You'll never run out for one thing. Um, <laughs> Um, but it's a really good shade. So uh, if you want to do uh, some body bronzing without doing, you know, the fake tan, this is really good. And for fair skin, this is a pretty good bronzer. So actually better than pretty good. It's really good. So um, I think that's actually my video for today. And I hope that you have a great day. And I will go ahead and see you later. Bye.